Let me tell you the truth. Whether your father had you for, or your mother had you for someone that rejected you as a child, should not define the way you see your life. It's not the end of the world. See, there is no mistake when it comes to creation. Because if you are not meant to be here, God will not allow you to be here. The fact that you are here right now means that there is a purpose for your life. So the fact that that man rejected you, or the fact that those friends rejected you, or the fact that the world rejected you, should not define the way you define yourself. When minister was speaking, he said, the world can reject you, but your own rejection of yourself is what is toxic. I want you to say to yourself that I am not rejected. I said, I said, it can happen from hatred. People can just hate you. See, you see this life, everybody will not like you. If you're praying for everybody to like you, maybe you don't want to be human. Maybe you can sample and be ice cream. You know, everybody likes ice cream except my son, David. So even ice cream, everybody does not like ice cream. I mean, I never exposed him to things like that. So one day we went out and they offered him ice cream. He sang all the ice cream songs. Ice cream, ice cream. But when it comes to putting the ice cream in his mouth, he said no. He rejected the ice cream. You know, and because they put it in a cone, the ice cream started to melt. And I was trying to tell him that, oh God, you need to lick this thing. The more I try to help him lick it, the more he takes his hand away. And he continues to sing the nursery rhyme. Ice cream, ice cream. But he did not lick it. So if you're like that, you know that you're supposed to make them feel better. You know that God has positioned you as a solution, yet you are rejected. Don't worry now. Abby, are you not the solution? Why are you feeling bad when they reject you? It is their loss, not yours. That's exactly what it is. Okay, maybe yours is not even the case of family. Maybe yours is a case of, you know, you applied for a visa at an embassy. And haven't prepared and done all that you're supposed to do. They still said, access denied. Sorry. And you feel rejected. And you said to yourself, but the promises of God concerning me this year is this, is that this year is my year of unbelievable elevation. Pastor already declared it that I will not be rejected. Take a chill pill. Pause. And recognize that rejection acknowledge it and find out what it is sent to do in your life see you know i told you that everybody has been rejected including the ultimate influencer in the world jesus christ today is an influencer everybody is shouting jesus jesus is the new cool he has been cool for several thousands of years but he was rejected and i want to read it to us in the book of john chapter one like i said verse six to eleven is somebody there? John chapter 1, verse 6 to 11. It says, there was a man sent from God whose name was John. He came as a witness to testify concerning that light so that through him all might believe. He himself was not the light. He came only as a witness to the light. Verse 9. The true light that gives light to everyone was coming into the world. He was in the world. And though the world was made through him. The world did not recognize him. He came to that which was his own. But his own did not receive him. That's the Lord Jesus Christ. He came as light. He came for us. He came to die for us. Yet the same world is. <laughs> God.